story of lost love and lots of determination. A Chicago woman runs back into her burning home to save her wedding dress. Yeah, that was on Christmas night exactly three weeks ago. And despite the family losing everything, the wedding went on the very next day. Jackie and Jeremy and their three young kids, plus this cute puppy and cat, are getting used to their new normal. Until Christmas night, the family, plus Jeremy's mother and sister, lived here in this Albany Park 2 flat. It's been in the family for four generations. The family had gathered in our home for the last time, and we were smelling smoke. The minute that clicked in our heads, I think we were shoeless. Uh, no coats, nothing, just, I, I don't know who made it downstairs first. And I ran back outside and realized, oh my God, I'm getting married tomorrow. My wedding dress is inside. So I ran back inside to get my wedding dress. The good news, everyone made it out okay, but with only the clothes on their back. The bad news, everything else was destroyed. Amanda's then fiance rushed to the home, and as they watched it burn, they made a decision. I wanted to postpone maybe... And he said, absolutely not. My mom was like, I don't know, you know, I, I can't leave you guys at this. Like, no, mom, you're going, you're getting married. This, this isn't going to stop us. Jackie, who got her family settled in a hotel, didn't have much time to get them ready. The kids were in their onesies. I threw their clothes on them in the basement of the church, and I stood there in slippers and sweats. You got your dress out. I did. It had some smoke damage and some soot on the bottom of it but I still work. My son, even though he had lost everything, but now I, I am he walked me down the aisle with a smile on his face. Our love just conquered. A lot of love here, but still a lot of loss. It was also kind of sad because I wouldn't be able to go back to my childhood home after school. Yeah. And I really miss it. It could have been a lot worse. As long as your family gets out, you have everything. Yeah, that's most important. The family plans to move back into the home once it's rebuilt. Amanda, as previously planned, has now moved in with her new husband. Now, the family wants to thank everyone who has helped replace destroyed Christmas presents, who've helped donate items. You can still help them. There's a GoFundMe page we've linked on CBSChicago.com. You can see it's raised over $5,000. So people really touched by the story of this family who said, we're going to go through with this wedding no matter what. We're going to push on and persevere. And